Hey guys, welcome back to My Singing Monsters. So I just got back from a lovely 10 day vacation and now I have some things to get caught up on. So first of all, as you can see, Magical Sanctum looks a little bit different and that's because right now we've got the Crescendo Moon event going on and they added two new monsters to this island. We've got the Caralong, which we've seen before on Seasonal Shanty and we have the rare Zister. I'm gonna be honest guys, at first when I saw the new monster, I was like, who the heck is that? I forgot the Zister even existed. <laughs> uh, this, is a, this is a monster that can read your mind. So that's, that's pretty great. So if we wanna get the rare Zister, we just need to try and breed a regular Zister and hope it ends up being a rare one, which will be easy enough to do because we have an Enchantling and it's a very low chance of actually getting him. So we can just combine Enchantling and Zister and go. That's not what I want. Well, I can throw that over there, I suppose, and keep going. That's the, gotta be the same thing, right? Oh, geez. Well, let's try this breeder down here. Maybe this one's gonna help us out, huh? No. Darn you monster handlers for stealing my diamonds. Just be nice to me. Okay, fourth time's the charm. No, it ain't. I'm gonna just have bad luck, aren't I? That's, that's what's gonna happen. I'm gonna have bad luck and I have to spend a whole bunch of diamonds every time I fail. That's over a hundred diamonds spent now. It only costs like a couple hundred to buy it. Come on! I got all my torches lit thanks to you beautiful people watching this video and smashing the like button. But I still, still can't get my rare zister. It's too late to turn back. 31 diamonds per fail. Whatever. That's gotta be the one. Oh, there it is, rare zister. Okay, I think I managed to do it slightly cheaper than if I just bought it from the store. So I, I don't know if that's a good thing or not. I was hoping for, I was hoping to save more diamonds, you know? There it is. Wow, it's kind of, uh, oh, it doesn't look quite as good as the common one. So different types of bone in there. And obviously, you know, you got a lot of little, little pointy things sticking off you. Tell me more about you. Lacking the elongate antlers of the common Zister, this rare magical nevertheless has adapted itself to collect the thoughts of nearby beings. That said, it sets its sights on a much bigger target than mere monsters. It can listen in on the ruminations of the Enchantler itself. The what? Okay, the Enchantler is the titan of this island. Got it, so you can listen to the, to the titan. The rare Zister is able to accomplish this via various villi covering its body that maximize surface contact as it tunnels through the pores of the Titan. I don't know if I'd want anyone tunneling into my pores. That doesn't sound very nice. So that's what the little bumps are for anyway, guys. They're villi. Oh. Let me know what you guys think of this one down below, but I gotta say, I'm really not digging the look of it. I don't like the colors. Sorry. Okay, next up, we're gonna get the Caralong on Magical Sanctum. We need to combine a Mushaboom and a Rorik. All right, so we're gonna have the same, uh, the same fail penalty, 31 diamonds per fail. It's okay. I'm sure I'm gonna get it in no time. Oh, wait a minute. What's that? The Caralong, it only took me two attempts. I love it. I can't remember what this thing does, but I'm pretty sure it just goes ding, ding, ding. Yeah. Basically, well, if this monster is just supposed to stare at its instrument, it's doing a great job. Hmm. Okay. This definitely fits the vibe of the song, which I like. I like the vibe of this island, you know? It's very like low key. I mean, aside from the Hugo part, other than that, it's pretty, it's pretty low key, you know? Okay, you guys go ahead and just, just scream. I'm gonna get out of here because I want to go to Amber Island. I've already got this monster ready to go, guys, and I'm kind of excited about it, okay? Because it's a new monster. These these two, one of them was new to look at, and the other one we've already seen before, but this one. Today, guys, we are getting ourselves a bowhead. It is some sort of whale creature. Look at that thing right here. It's beautiful, isn't it? Oh, 80 diamonds! What the heck, what do you mean? Three days and eight hours. Come on out here. How dare you? Okay. <laughs> there it is. Okay. So guys, I'm pretty sure this is kind of like a Bogart, except with a little less Gart and a little more head. 
or something. It is a string instrument and that is nice. Okay, I don't know how it's gonna sound, but I'm assuming it won't sound too bad. I mean, I just heard a little bit of it. I don't think it'll sound too bad, but the rest of the monsters in here, so let's get it going. Oh. 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 <laughs> I love how nothing else is happening. He's just rubbing his own baleen over here. Oh, it's very, it's very beautiful. A little bit eerie, you know? Guys, my, my, my island's a little bit weird, okay? My amber island, because I just don't have room for all the monsters, and I'm very close to being able to, you know, upgrade this castle. I don't have enough relics, but like I only need like 40 something more, except for the fact that we need to get ourselves a rare Flummox. But not before I read the description on this beautiful creature. One of the deepest diving denizens of the living ocean, the majestic bowhead breaches above the surface and harnesses miraculous ocean currents to levitate ashore and show everyone a whale of a time by listening closely to the low pitched Infrasonic sounds echoing along these currents. This quint element monster memorizes and masters their resonant melodies. Gliding to tuber clit tu tuberkled? Tuberkled? That can't be right, can it? Gliding something? Gliding tuberkled flippers across its baleen. The bowhead produces superb euphonious bass and always gives a criller performance. It's believed that some of the water top boss's most identifiable traits are also expressed in a land dwelling cousin. Which land dwelling cousin are you talking about? Honestly guys, I'm kind of disappointed that this monster isn't on Water Island when it's very clearly a water monster, but you can't have a five element monster on Water Island, so I guess we'll we'll just make do with this, you know? It does sound nice. I uh, I just feel like this island is probably not going to do it justice. There are other monsters that can, you know, play along with this one, I'm pretty sure. I just, I have them all in here, okay? How about we take them out? We'll take out the monsters that play with him so we can see what it sounds like. Here it comes. Okay. Okay. You know what? If you can improve on Glowl a little bit, I respect it. It's kind of hard to do. Not a big fan of what Glowl's doing over here. Okay, okay, again, I'll say it one more time. This guy deserves more. He's great. All right, guys, next up, we are gonna turn our normal, everyday, common Flummox into a rare Flummox. And I gotta say, the rare Flummox looks really good. Okay, well, let's go ahead and breed it. I'll put in some more of these. I wanna make sure it happens. It's probably not gonna happen. They're probably just gonna unfurl my flag. Oh, 19 hours, that's a flag. That's gotta be a flag. Oh, wow. And I wonder why I never have enough relics to do what I want in this game, guys. How about now? Two days, that looks a lot better. Let's see it. 53 diamonds, really? Okay. It has evolved! Wow! What is it? I don't know how to describe this thing. This is a very nice monster, guys. I really like the color scheme on this one. What is your deal? Venturing into colder climates than their common cousins, rare flummoxen sports striped shaggy coats. But what happens when the quad's normally pliant horns are exposed to extreme cold? They bend and snap. This doesn't appear to harm the monster in any way, thankfully, but it does expose the secret to the species' ability to reshape its horns at will. A phosphorescent compound, not unlike the acid in mussels, courses through them and initiates a chemical reaction that forms the various gestures for which the monster is known. Okay, hang on a second. I think I know what's going on here. So these things split in two? Is that what happened here? Let me, let me look at the other one for a second. Yeah. Yeah, that is what happened. Oh, jeez. Well, yeah, I'm glad it doesn't hurt because it kind of looks like it would. Okay, well, I feel like I would be a lot happier with my Amber Island if I could actually have all the monsters out here at once, but all in good time, guys. I'll get a few more relics one of these days. I think I got 40-something when I logged in today, so that was nice. We gotta get going. Okay, we gotta go all the way to Wublin Island. Now, do you notice anything different about my Wublin Island? Of course you do. All the Wublins are gone, except for 
These guys, the Zinths. I'm working on a Zinth farm, okay? Slowly but surely. But that's not what we're, uh, that's not what we're here for, okay? We're here for this guy. Now, if, if the monsters are gone, that must mean that they're inside the wall box. Because you know I'm not just going to get rid of them. Okay, they're all in here. Having a great time, I'm sure. They're definitely not in terrible pain or anything. No, no. So obviously I'm going to wake this guy up. He is actually my third last monster in the entire game. But first, I want to wake up these guys. Now I didn't get all the Wublins again because I don't even like all the Wublins. So I picked a few that I kind of love. You know what I'm saying? I mean, how could you not love the Dermot? Zappy zappy bro, look at you. Look at you. <laughs> He's so disgusting. So disgusting. But It almost sounds like music, doesn't it? Almost. This guy is great, not just for his sounds, but also just his facial expressions. You know, he's just like kind of chilling out and then he goes, oh, <laughs> oh God, what's happening? Guys, I have the most cursed Wublin Island and Celestial Island. They both do this to me. They just boot me out all the time. Whatever, let's keep going. Wyja, you know I love the Wyja guys, okay? I mean, how could I not? Look at him. Isn't he beautiful? Oh, we'll get our Pixelotl as well. Zappy, zappy. Alrighty. Now, I was gonna get the Bon Appetit, guys, but I ran out of time. I was trying to do this before I went on vacation. So, uh, I got everybody else, and then I gave up on the Bon Appetit. Oh well, that's really starting to sound like music now, guys. Oh yeah. Zap some more. Here he comes. Play it! Play it! There we go, okay, and, oh my god, guys. Probably my favorite monster on Wublin Island. One of the best monsters in the whole game, okay? There's not enough bass guitar in this game. Okay, I wanted to look this up, guys, because I didn't want to do anyone dirty here because this is clearly not a normal bass guitar that he's playing. He's playing a double bass, which is like, kind of like a cello. So, yeah. Anyone anyone out there playing the double bass? Probably not a lot of you, but uh, go you. Okay. So now, guys, we got a nice little team of Wublins on this island. I don't care about any of the other Wublins except for my Wobbox. So it's finally time to wake this guy up. I feel like he's going to be really disappointing, okay? I feel like... I'm not gonna be happy after I hear it because most of the common wall boxes don't sound that great, but power it up. You never know. I can bigify this guy. Let's bigify him just for a little bit. Mm. It's, it's okay, I guess. It's not terrible, okay? It's not terrible. There are worse wall boxes out there. And some of them just kind of make the song sound a lot worse, okay? This one's all right. All right! Well, I'm not as disappointed as I could be, guys, so that's pretty great. Now we need to move on to the last island, okay? Take a look at this. We'll go backwards here. I got them all, okay? Just want to point it out one more time. I got to point it out in this video because I'm about to get the last one, so I want you to know that I got the last one. You can't even tell. It looks like I have a full collection everywhere, but I don't because Gold Island doesn't tell you the collection. Okay, there is no collection on Gold Island. I mean, I do be collecting though. Now this is gonna be a little bit weird, guys, because the way it works on Gold Island is you get a monster to level 15 and then you can place them on Gold Island, but they still exist on the island they're from. However, if you take that monster and you box it, it disappears from both islands. So I'm actually gonna be losing some monsters today, but it's no big deal because I've got lots of them. I mean, I, I don't care about the commons anyway. We can get the commons anytime, but the rare well box gonna be a bit more of an issue. We do have a lot of things to get, but I, I have I have money, okay? Don't worry. Okay, so I, I guess we should just, I don't know, start boxing, right? Let's just start boxing it up. I don't know if I even have everything here that I need, but it'll be really easy to tell because I can just check the inventory after I'm done getting rid of everybody. I really hope they put an epic wall box on this island, guys. I feel like they should, considering there are epic monsters on this island, but who knows what they're gonna do? Who knows where the next epic wall box is gonna be? Goodbye, there goes you in your costume, and you gotta lose your costume as well, I'm so sorry. Guys, some of these monsters are iconic. That's Roger! We're getting rid of Roger today! I'm so sorry, Roger! I know you're doing all right, Nerdo. I knows it. The song is slowly disappearing, guys. Ferg. Ferg, I can't. Ferg, there's no friggin' way I'm doing that, Ferg. We got another one. 
We got a backup here somewhere, right? Apparently we don't have a backup, but I'm gonna, oh God. Oh, that was a bad sound, guys. I didn't like the way that sounded. Um, you, you got the costume on, but you're just a regular old ant brat. But I can just, I'll just get another one, okay. Okay, there goes the ant brats, guys. The island is starting to look a little bit sad. It's okay. I don't like this. Yippee! <laughs> and now all we got left is the seasonals and my dude up here, okay? And the sugar bush. I don't know what you call him. He's he's not natural. That's all I know. He's a freak of nature, obviously. I mean, look at him. <laughs> beautiful song you got here. Real beautiful. Who am I missing? Pango. That's it. How much to fill? 300 diamonds? What are you crazy? What are you out of your mind? Guys, I like, I actually like this. Oh God, there it is again. The sad noise when you come to any island now because of what I did on Gold Island. What happens on Gold Island stays on Gold Island. Except it doesn't because it directly affects the other islands. Oh geez. Here is our pango. And now we're ready. We're ready to do it. I, I don't know guys, I'm a little bit nervous. Okay, I know the song's gonna be a little bit weird now because there's no one here. I can get other people here, don't worry. And I will. But I, I'm nervous that it's gonna sound kind of bad. We're doing okay so far though. This is kind of nice. Like it's actually kind of nice just having the sugar bush going to town with this guy. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. Whoa. I feel like he's a little different with his animations or something. It's a lot more jiggly. Maybe I'm just not, like, maybe I just haven't noticed it before. Okay, listen, it's not that bad, okay? It's not that bad. It's like the best I can say about the uh, the common wall boxes. It's not that bad. It could be worse. Okay, so now I need to, I basically need to go to every island now and uh, and get a rare to level 15 and then say goodbye to it forever. Well, let's see if we have anything here. We got anything here? That's an epic. I mean, I'll put you there just so you can be part of the song. Okay, I just spent over 10 million food and now look at that, 48 monsters I can place on this island. Wow, mostly rares. I also got some epics because epics are cool. Okay, and they're, they're not going away. So I don't mind putting them here. Okay, look at that. This island looks a little busier now, doesn't it? Well, don't worry, because it won't look like that for long. Time to box up all of the rares. How many are there? I'm gonna say 20 uh, something. I don't wanna count. All right, guys, everything is boxed. I'm just moving a few things out of the way, and then it is time to see the final rare wall box. The final monster in this game. The only one I have not heard yet. That's crazy. I cannot believe the day is finally here. Matt Shea completed his entire collection in My Singing Monsters. If you even consider this completing the collection, because like I said, there is no collection here, and that's because they're not actually on this island, but whatever, okay? Power it up. There it is! Oh my god! I wonder what he says. I wonder what kind of weird thing comes out of his mouth, man. What? Error? Something about error, error, powering down, loading. I think he says error, powering down, loading. On Gold Island, it says error, error, uh, 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 file not found, wub, wub, wub box, failed to launch, l -l loading, loading. Oh, well, I thought it said powering down. That's what it sounded like to me. Okay, guys, I feel like this is extra important because this is the final rare wall box and the final monster, but I have come up with my own lyrics for this that I think kind of fit, okay? It's it's only fair that we do it. We, we've come up with our own lyrics for every other rare wall box, okay? Here's what I think he says. That's, that's what I think he says. <laughs> All right, guys, so there you go. I don't really know how to feel about it, but I kind of just completed my singing monsters. Of course, there is the Colosseum, and I have a few monsters missing here or there, but 
we experienced all the content. We heard every every track from every monster in this game, and that's kind of wild. So thank you so much for watching. There will be more videos, okay? Don't worry about that. We've got Fan Made, we've got Top Islands, we've got uh, My Singing Monsters Dawn of Fire, and of course the Monster Handlers are gonna release more updates. So yeah, content's not something you gotta worry about, okay? There will be My Singing Monsters videos. Thank you guys so much for watching, and if you wanna check out another one of my videos, that'd be super cool. How about, how about this one? It's right there for you to click on. Click it.